For today's drum set rudiment video, we're taking the pattern kick right, right, left, and we're displacing it and looking at another way it can be used as well. And here's a quick note about the phrasing. For kick right, right, left, and then right, left, kick, right, those two different versions of this pattern, keep the left hand soft, or at least try it that way. I found the phrasing to be better and to feel better and more natural, keeping the left hand low on those. For the remaining two patterns, right, right, left, kick, and then left kick right right. Feel free to bring the volume up for that left hand, play a rim shot, play around with the articulation of it, but for those two, the volume of the left hand can really come out. For the others, I found that it made sense with the phrasing to keep it softer. Another really interesting way we can use kick right, right, left is we can use it to sort of hack a Latin genre or a Latin feel referred to as soca. This comes from Trinidad and this is one of the grooves that gets played in steel pan music. We can take kick right, right, and left and just orchestrate it on the drum set a certain way and all of a sudden we're kind of playing soca. We can play our right hand on the hi-hat and by releasing the hi-hat on the and of the beat, so my feet sort of are going kick and kick and kick and on the and I'm sort of easing the tension on the hi-hat. I also play a right hand on the and, kick right, right, left, kick right, right, left. And if we just go kick right, right, left, kick right, right, kick right, right, left, kick right, right, that gives us a real sweet soca feel. 